Okay, in this video, I'm going to show you how you can leave a ringless voicemail message for one of your contacts, which is a great feature. It allows you to uh, record a piece of audio in advance and then have it delivered to the contacts um, mobile phone's voicemail box without ever ringing them. So there's not going to be any uh, live conversation if you just wanted to put a message in there without interacting live with your customer, your contact. So these are great. You can create them in a number of ways, but I'm going to start by going to my lists and I'm going to choose that demo list that we created. And you can choose from among one or more of the contacts on that list. You can multiply select a number of people here and then uh, or just choose one. And then with this pull down, this action pull down, you're going to choose drop ringless voicemail RVM. Um, so, in order to do a, a ringless voicemail, you're going to need at least two tw configured Twilio phone numbers on your account. And that's because of the way we, we deliver this message. Uh, the select a from phone number. This is the phone number that's actually going to leave that re re recorded message. So I'm going to use my training demo line. So the, the person hearing that ringless voice, hearing that voicemail message wants to call me back this is the one that they're going to be dialing me back at. But in order for this feature to work, we also need a second phone, which we call the filter phone number. And you can choose from among any of your other configured lines. In this course, in this case, I only have two, so it's selecting the sales department. And because uh, the, what's, the process that's actually going to happen is our software is going to dial that person first using the filter phone number. But while it is mid-ring, before they even have the opportunity to answer and begin a, a live conversation, we're going to hang up. Um, the only reason we did that single ring was in order to tie up their phone line so that quickly, you know, in under a fraction of a second, this second phone line is also going to call that lead. And detecting that they are already, you know, their line is already busy because they're already on that first call, um, we're going to get sent straight to their voicemail box. And that's why you need two phone numbers, one to act as the decoy to knock on the front door. And while they're while they're busy, you know, we sneak in the back door. So um, you check off a filter line and the from line. And now you can select from your audio. Now, if you had a recorded audio file on your local desktop computer, you could choose this option and then browse to the file. You can also record right here live in the in the software using this record button. Or if you have previously recorded something already and saved it as a template, and I do have one such piece of audio, you can choose it from your previously selected ones. Um, you can schedule it for now, or you can schedule a date and time that you want to send this out to. I'm going to send mine now. And then finally, you're going to want to um, check off that you have permission to, uh, to contact these persons just as a compliance uh, requirement. And when you sit, sit, submit, um, this one is going to send it off immediately. It's going to ring Mark's phone uh, once and then leave the voicemail in the background. Uh, you can also initiate a, um, a ringless voicemail using the templates feature up here. So over here in templates, uh, you can see that I've created under the RVM tab an existing template that basically follows the exact same steps that you just saw. It uses the same filter number, the same from number. I even use the same piece of audio. And um, there's the, the button if you, if you might need to edit it. Um, but now that it's a template, I can use it in things like my campaigns. You'll see in another video that we have a, a feature that lets you string together multiple messages into a campaigns. And once you've saved a, a ringless voicemail as one of your uh, templates, then you can select it again from a campaign and leave that same ringless voicemail for all of your incoming leads. So it's a terrific feature and a um, great way to get someone's attention. Um, they might not answer a phone call, but they'll absolutely listen to a voicemail that you've left behind. And it can work great in conjunction with other channels. If you're sending emails, SMS, texts, leave them a voicemail. Hey, I just sent you a text message. Uh, go ahead and reply if you're interested. Um, it's a great way to combine features and, uh, and get the best response.